Hey you guys, uh, today I want to just show you, um, like, kind of have a review on the Master Shots 3600 Pro Qualifier um, Tackle Bag. And I just want to, and I want to show you, um, kind of how I organize my, all my baits for, um, shore fishing and stuff like that, bank fishing. Um, how I set it up. And so, I'll, um, show you what I got in my open compartment. And, Usually in the springtime, I'll have all my swim baits in there. They're in one box, but um, at this time of the year, I don't have swim baits in my box, so I don't need to keep those in there. But um, first, I just keep some um, box things on top because I have extra room. And then I have my frog box, all my frogs in there, divided out and organized. These um, are all in 3600 boxes. Some of them are a little different, but just different times that I've gotten them. And these are my home and toads from Bass Pro Shops, all different colors. I got them in a like a pack like this. They were like pretty cheap, so I picked them up, and it came with a whole box of them. I keep all those in one box, and that's all I keep on top. But I'll get those in there. And then this front front um pocket. I keep all my hooks and stuff like that. There's just some EWG hooks from Mustad that I got in a mystery tackle box and then VMC worm hooks size 1 and 1 knot. Keep those in these little um, velcro um, po pockets. And then I have all my swim bait hooks and my um, shaky heads and then um, all size wide gaps and um, Carolina rig things, and then some just regular offset hooks and my drop shot things. And I have like two little um, Plano boxes tape tape back to back, so you can kind of flip them over and stuff. You can experiment with these things. It's just how I like to do them. And right up here, I keep some clippers, Rapala clippers, and my measuring tape um, in this Velcro part. And down here, I keep some bug spray and um, some leaders for pike fishing if I want to do that with my swim baits. That's all I keep down there. Um, then there's four 3600 boxes down here. Um, in this box, I have all my jigs, swim jigs. There's some swim jigs, and those um, two swim jigs, some football head jigs football head and a flipping jig and then I have all my spinner baits in a bag I'm supposed to be getting I should be getting um a spinner bait organizer soon so I can put them in there but for now I have that I'm gonna have a chatter bait a buzz bait down there and a skirtless spinner bait that I haven't put a skirt on yet but anyways now I keep that all that in one box in the next box I have my lip, all my lipless crankbaits, there's just some live targets, some, and then rattle traps, um, these are Apollo rattle traps, live target, um, shallow diving crankbaits, then I got, um, sexy shad colored crankbaits, they're, they, these dive from 5 to, well, 3 to 0 foot, and then there's the excite baits, um, that's sexy, sexy shad color. All, just about all my crankbaits dive from about 5 foot to 0 foot, so um, shallow water fishing on the banks and stuff. And then all my crawfish colored, a few more crawfish, and then some more crawfish right there. All that in my box. And then I keep my jerk baits, jerk baits, there's my jointed baits, two jointed, four jointed baits, I mean. And then my poppers, my stick baits. And some more top water hard baits. And then last, I keep all my terminal, any kind of terminal in there. It goes all the way down to the bottom. And then some hook keepers and some more like snap soles, different, different um, terminal tackle in there. And this um, 3600 per qualifier from Best for Shops is great. It has all these little hidden pockets. I keep some stringers in there, um, some real oil, and some um, 
eye glue just to for fixes and some of those um, box separators. And then this side, I just have all my weights in a bag. There's some tungsten weights, some bullet weights, uh, finesse weights, some weights, um, hook weights, different things in there. And then that's all in that pouch. And I keep my pair of braid scissors and some pliers in this side pouch. And then I hang my um, scale on this little clip. And um, this little ring is used for your rods if you want to carry them around on that. Um, yeah. And this um, thing, it divides into two so you can carry it um, for like smaller loads instead of carrying it on your back. And I have, um, if you unzip this, I keep some like knot, different knots. Well, if I can get it unzipped. I have a bunch of knots on there, um, just just for reference if I ever need a new knot. But anyways, this thing is full of um, different places you can organize things in, different ways you can organize them, and it's great for um, um, bank fishing if you're a bank fisherman, and um, it's been really good for me. Uh, carry it on your back everywhere you go it's got back straps so you can carry it like a book bag and it um, stores a lot of stuff so you might want to check that out at BassPressShops.com or local Bass Pro Shops and um, get you one it's really great and that's about all I'm going to be doing in this video so um, thanks for watching like comment subscribe and I'll see you later